Hello everyone, welcome to December Chit Chat. I hope you are doing well. Before we get started, I want to share with you my favorite December project so far, which is this one. It's super cute slipper stockings. If you haven't seen a tutorial for this stockings, I can put a link in the description below. I've designed this stocking, I think it was three years ago. But at the time, I'm not quite confident with my writing down the uh, footwear pattern yet. I cannot put it aside. And every year around this time, I have a lot of messages asking me when I'm going to make a written pattern for this stockings. And here it is. Finally, I love these stockings so much and I decided to make another one in green. Look at these. Highly recommend these stockings. Yeah, which one do you like best? Green or red? I cannot choose. Both are super cute. And I wonder, have you seen this tutorial yet? Please comment below. And I know some of you already make a couple pairs of these stockings, which make me very happy. <laughs> okay. I also have another project that I just finished, which is this house slippers. I didn't make a pattern or tutorial for this one because I'm not sure if you are interested in this. Just please let me know. Look at this detail around here. I just changed color around here. I think it's beautiful. This is Lion Brand Woolies Thick and Quick. Number six, super bulky weight yarn. Okay. And I have a lot of flowers here. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna make, but I just wanna make it. It's so beautiful. <laughs> Let me show you. Look at this. Which color do you like? Which one do you like? I cannot choose. I also have purple. Beautiful. This is a Alice Bella yarn. I don't know how you pronounce it. Alice or Alice? I don't know, but yeah, so beautiful. I have this yarn at least three years. And when I'm working on project, I like to put in the zip lock like this and put my hook in here. Otherwise, I forget what hook did I use. And sometimes I write it down on the paper and put it in here, like what hook that I use, because sometimes I use the same hook for many projects at the same time. So yeah, a little tips. I have something that I wanna share with you. I have this knitted sweater for a while and I worn it a couple times and I don't like it because it's too short in length and it's too wide. I love an oversized sweater, but this one is just not balanced. It's too short. I gonna redo it. And this is a number four medium weight yarn. And I think I gonna hold two strands of this yarn together and knit this sweater instead because this one uses a bulky weight yarn. That is the plan, but we'll see. The tutorial for this knitted sweater is on the channel. I also gonna put the link in the description below. I share this with you because I want you to know if it's okay to restart your project again. Even though you have finished it, it's beautiful, but you just don't like it. Just restart it, right? You know, some of you like ask me, send me a private messages, like they're scared to make a mistake, scared to redo the project again. But this is a part of the game. If you want to be good at it, I would say good at anything, you're going to make mistake and then keep trying, I think. Anyways, for this December, I want to challenge myself. So I have a lot of leftover yarn. I have 
seven balls of leftover yarn here and I was thinking I'm gonna make seven different projects for this seven balls of leftover yarn. What do you think? I think it's gonna be very fun. And I might mix the color together, but I will make sure I have seven projects. And I'm not gonna make a pattern, but I'm gonna make a tutorial. If you have a leftover yarn, and I'm sure you do, you can follow along with the tutorial. I think it's gonna be fun. Some of this yarn, I'm not even know where it's come from. <laughs> But this one I know, this is a line brand, wool is thick and quick, same as this one. And this one is line brand jean yarn. Two of these are red heart hookah yarn. But this one I don't know. And this one I think, what is called? Um, Luck Craft or Paga Solid from Joanne. This is the same yarn that I use for my even more stitch sweater. This one right here. The video tutorial is on the channel. And yeah, I'm so excited for it. And that's all I have for this December chit chat. And I will see you on day one of Leftover Yarn Project. Bye bye.